Hello, this is Teddy Gun here, and welcome back to another review on the Supergirl Season 5, Episode 11. So, in last review, we saw the team and win take down Toy Man from the future. No, from a different Earth. So, let's get into this one. Let's go. So of course this wouldn't be an all hour verse video if I'm doing two different parts. So the first so the first part which I'm gonna talk about is about Lex Luthor and it is a very disappointing episode, I'm not gonna lie. I mean we've already done this episode before and the only difference is like a different villain. Yeah. So the Lex Luthor story is that he goes to talk to Leviathan and then Lothian um takes or thinks they're controlling him but yeah, and that's pretty much where Lex Luthor's story really goes and really ends. And yeah, it's disappointing. So then you got the other story, which is the main focus, but still isn't really part. It's still disappointing because we've done this bloody episode before. Okay, yeah. Okay, so basically, um, in this episode we see uh Kara and the new boy, uh, doing karaoke. I think they said it was soon Africa. I don't get me wrong, it was a interesting version of the song. Doesn't mean it was actually good or they could actually sing it properly. And yeah, he, the man asked her out on a date. They, then they had to make an excuse because somehow the DO is under attack by Toy Man. So they will go to stop the, uh, the attack. But when they're there, it turns out basically the Toy Man's got into his systems and is going to really uh, going to attack the whole internet if they don't let him loose. I think that's what his main plot was. So then they have come up with that idea that basically if they get to a server room, they can stop it. So Kara and Wynn go off to do that. We get uh, Alex and her team trying to. Basically, get rid of all the smart bits from their technology. But then we have Sexy Brainy who comes back, and oh boy, is it a treatment to watch him again? Yeah, I've missed him over the last two weeks. Um, so he gets the uh, so he needs to work for Lex Luthor again, and he gets so in this one he needs to get the code of that uh, Toy Man used. So you can, so you can, so Lex Luthor can upload himself up to the system. So you go on, sexy brainy, hashtag sexy brainy, everyone. And oh, no, 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 not sexy brainy, sexy, um, no, hashtag sexy raft. That's our thing. So yeah, let's make a meme out of it, guys. So meanwhile, we got um, so while Kara and Wind down in the server room, they find out that Wind's original or the original toy man, aka Wind's dad. Is still alive in the like computer verse, I guess. If that makes sense. And he tries to help them, but uh, they don't accept it. So when they go and actually find the server room, and the only way to actually shut them down was to actually get inside of the system. So when he goes through that, meanwhile we got and meanwhile with Alex, uh, the uh, Lex bots come out to fight. And and everyone's really panicking because they can do a lot more damage. So she goes goes up there to try to stop them, but then she gets uh, shot at, and then Brainy has a good idea by sh uh, sending up a, a chair on fire to them. And oh god, hashtag sexy raft everyone. So then, um, meanwhile in the computer verse, uh, Win fights um him the toy man. He lets uh, the original toy man lose. He then uh, does the code thing and then kills both of them. And yeah, oh well. So what? So they're dead. Oh well. And he was surprised, but basically, the uh, division toy man has changed. Yeah, I wasn't surprised. I mean, a little bit, but I couldn't really care less. Meanwhile, back up in the real world, he got a uh, sexy raft, aka Brainy, takes off his shirt, uh, his jumper, reels the light. He runs in and then just jump in. 
Oh god, yes, right. Oh, it's just rough. Oh yes, you do. You do a good job in this show. Hashtag se uh, sexy rough, everyone. And he's uh, basically he's, uh, Carl defeats them all, and that's where the episode really ends. The final bit about this episode looks like Wynn's gonna leave. Alex leaves the DO. Brandon becomes the new director of the DO. And at the very end of the episode, the um, Mr. Meat Fix, the person in season two who had a fight with Monel, he came back. Who, yeah, he's gonna be a uh, completely another novel for the next episode. But I think that's a bit understandable because it's episode 100. So, yeah, it should be good. Should be. So, overall, I was very disappointed in this episode because we've done this sort of stuff before. And then we get Kara asking someone out on a date. I mean, that's not the worst part. It was the person she's asking on a date, um, on a date with. That's the only part I was disappointed with. Well, no, there's a few other parts, but that's my biggest complaint. Uh, there was no real good things to it other than sexy Ralph doing, oh god, yes, those jumps. Oh, yes. Well, that's it for today, guys. If you're the one, please share, like, subscribe, and all that stuff. Good. Bye. Yo. Bye.